Okay, bro. Okay. Okay. Darvin Ham. Darvin Ham. I know you're fired up. I know you're excited about the roster that you have with the Lakers and all that. But let's be very clear, Darvin Ham. Can I be real with you? The Denver Nuggets is still the defending champions. The Denver Nuggets is still nothing to play with. You still got to deal with that team. You still got to deal with the head coach, Malone, over there. Now, y'all can take them for a joke if you want, but they got some firepower over there. And and another thing, Darvin Ham, I don't want to hear all the talking. I don't want to hear all the talking at all. I, I just want to make sure that you are just going to allow your actions speak louder than your words, making the right plays, making the right calls, um, doing the necessary things, you know what I'm saying, with your team. And I don't want to, I'm tired of hearing about LeBron James and Anthony Davis. I, I'm tired of hearing about it. Anthony Davis came out and he said he wanted to play 82 games. I very seriously doubt that he's going to do that. LeBron James, he's an old man. I know he's still going to produce, but he can't do it like he used to no more. He can't do it. So you're going to have to rely heavily on that nucleus of other teammates that LeBron James and Anthony Davis have, and hopefully they can produce at a high level in order for you to even have a chance to go deep in the playoffs. But there's this report on the Lakers daily. And um, you, you, you made some comments. Um, You said that our two captains are the most hungry. And your full quote was just his hunger, man. He and Brian, both our two captains are the most hungry. That's what's supposed to happen. D D ham. That's, that's what's supposed to happen. You, you, Le- Anthony Davis, man, for me, I'm not even sure Anthony Davis is even the leader of that team. Everybody know LeBron James is still the leader of that team. As old as he is, man, he still is the leader of that team. Anthony Davis is supposed to be, be, take the reins of being the leader, the captain of that team. And he's not because he does not have the fortitude mentally to be able to capable to lead other men. That's not in his DNA. Now, when you make comments like this, it's not scaring nobody. D. Ham, it's not. People don't care about A.D. and LeBron Ham. They don't put fear in their heart. Now, they may respect them to a certain extent, but they don't put fear in other people's heart. You see how much junk that the, um, the Nuggets was talking? You saw how much junk they was talking? You saw how much junk the coach was talking about y'all? They ain't worrying about y'all. They ain't scared of y'all. They say in a seven-game series, we going to win. We going to win. So now it's time to put up or shut up. I don't want to hear nothing about the mouth about how hungry AD and LeBron is. You going to really say that about AD? You really? How hungry? Because his ass did not look hungry at all. He looked malnutrition. He did not look hungry at all. The question is, if he going to show up, that's the thing. Come on, man. Talk is cheap, bro. I don't want to hear all that, man. I just want to see you play on October 24th. And guess who y'all playing? Y'all playing the Denver Nuggets. The Denver Nuggets. AD can talk all that junk he want. I remember he made a statement talk about, yeah, we heard all the talking. We heard all that. Let me kind of go into full quote and what happened. This is... um. D. Ham's quote. He said, just his hunger. He and Brian both. Ham said when asked if he noticed any differences in Davis during training camp. Our two captains are the most hungry. They understand the moment. They not worried about what happened last year or what next year is going to look like. They've submerged themselves into today, and that's the way you have to be, especially in this business. It's a marathon, but they are hungry as ever. They're intense. We have our fair share of fun for sure, but there's not a lot of fooling around or goofing off with this group they set a great tone for everybody being serious about the work that needs to be put in put in the word we all know that d ham put in the word the question is is whether they're going leather ad's action is going to line up with his words because talk is cheap brother talk is cheap 
check y'all out on the next episode of the Royal Figures podcast.